Hello, welcome to the Grants Portal How-To Videos, presented by FEMA's Public Assistance Training Section. Today's video will go over document management in Grants Portal. The Grants Portal has multiple places to upload documents. This graphic, commonly referred to as the Document Onion, offers an explanation of what the different layers are and what to upload into them. As you work your way towards the center, the more specific the document should be. The highest level of documentation or the outermost layer of the onion, is the organization profile. This is for documents that may pertain to multiple events in different years, like your payroll policy. The next layer is the applicant event profile. Every time you submit a request for public assistance, you will get an applicant event profile in Grants Portal. Documents uploaded at this level should pertain to multiple projects. The project level is for project-specific documents, Projects also have an area called Essential Elements of Information, EEIs, that are not represented in this graphic. The innermost layer of the graphic, or onion, is the damage level. Documents uploaded here should pertain only to this specific damage line item, such as photos and timesheets. Once you have an idea of what level you'd like to upload your document, log into Grants Portal. In Grants Portal, there are two main ways to upload a document. The first is to find the specific area you'd like to upload to. Using the left-hand navigation side, you can find the same layers of the onion. Organization profile, applicant event profile, projects, and damages. Pick the specific area you'd like to upload to. I'm going to upload a map of all the culverts associated with this project. So first, I will select projects on the left-hand side. Then I'll identify the correct project and click the magnifying glass next to it. On the projects page, scroll down to the documents tab. Clicking the tab will show you all the documents currently associated with the project, either uploaded directly to the project or into the project's EEIs. To upload a new document, go to the tab, and click Upload. You have two options once the new window appears. You can drag the document into the dotted box or you can click inside the dotted box and find the document on your computer. Click the correct document, then click Open. Both ways of uploading a document will require edits. You can see the yellow triangle with the exclamation point. Hovering over it tells you why. The same reason shows when you try to click Upload Pending Documents. Click Edit. On the Process Document window, you have the option to change the file name and add a description. Those are optional. You do need to add a category. The category dropdown shows you all of the potential categories. Grants Portal uses categories as an internal filing system. To help find a category, you can use the category filter above. The category tab also works as a keyword search. If unsure which category fits you best, you can add more than one category to a document. Click Save. Back on the upload window, you will see that one document now has a green check mark. Click Edit for the one that still has the yellow triangle. then click Save. Once the documents you are trying to upload all have green checks, click the Upload Pending Documents button. These steps work the same for all sections in Grants Portal. All other areas have the Upload button on the Document tab and follow the same steps. 
The second main way to upload documents is under Utilities on the navigation side. Click Utilities, then click Document Uploader. This is a condensed way to add documents to one of the four layers. The green arrow points to the specific area the document will be uploaded to. In order to get more specific, you have to start at the top with Organization, then select the Applicant Event Profile. From there, you can pick the project or the damage from the drop-down list. The green arrow will let you know where you are uploading to. Once you've picked where you want to upload, click the green Select Document button. Find the document on your computer, click the document, then click Open. Change the file name and description as needed, and select a category. A yellow box wording against PII will appear. Then click Upload Documents to Damage. When you get to the screen with the green box, you will know you have been successful. You can either click the first hyperlink to see where the document was uploaded, or click the second hyperlink to go back to the Document Uploader utility. Thank you for watching.